Hello everyone and welcome back to ADV Revival. This is Gold Mason. I am joined by no one this time, for the first time in six recordings. I'm trying my new mic out, I'm listening to my favorite song, and we're gonna launch right into these games. Amogus Fan vs Big Chungus. Suicune vs Vaporeon, that's not a great matchup for Suicune. But we have another water type coming in. Starmie's gonna be able to deal with Vaporeon a lot better though. Zapdos switching in on the Baton Pass. And Doug Trio comes in. I don't think that that's a particularly good Zapdos answer. Especially not with a sub up. Metagross comes in. Probably will deal with that sub at the cost of most of its HP. And Big Chungus looks pretty ahead right now. Metagross goes down, and uh, that's probably important for later. Tyranitar comes in, and that'll probably force Zapdos out here. Vaporeon's back on a rock slide. That's a lot of damage, and this Tyranitar is very light. Oh! I almost spoke too soon that Salic Berry is going to stop the uh, Tyranitar from being potentially faster, but oh my. That is a big crit on Suicune. Starmie receives the speed. Probably didn't need it. That Suicune is not regenerating in Sandstorm, so it is probably a Salic Berry or something similar. Yep, there it is, but I think it's just going to go down to Starmie here now. And it is not looking good for a Mogus fan in 2020. Zapdos is in, forcing uh, Starmie out. A big agility there. The Vaporeon's going to go down here, and Zapdos looks pretty strong into the other Zapdos and Starmie. Alright, we got Celebi in. That is a Zapdos answer. So once again... Uh, Big Chungus looks to be ahead. Psychic into the Baton Pass to Tyranitar. That's pretty good. We got a Dragon Dance. That is a very, very fast Tyranitar. And, I mean, it's possible that it just takes the game here, folks. I don't know. Hidden Power Bug kills Celebi. There's Jirachi. It's going to take an Earthquake. Lives. Hidden Power Grass is not going to take it down, though. And Jirachi's gone. I mean... I have no idea what's going to stop a Tyranitar here on that team. Zapdos is gone. Starmie will be gone shortly if it's sent out. Last Pokemon is going to be Dugtrio. Oh, wow. And that is a very quick game and a very uh, fast reversal for a Mogus fan here. Did not look good until the Baton Pass. All right. Well, let's keep it rolling. I'm hoping my mic doesn't sound too different. Tyranitar versus Metagross. So Tyranitar is going to switch into a Melodic. Metagross Meteor Mashes takes a solid chunk. It's possibility that that's a, uh, a uh, CB Metagross. And that's my first um with my new mic. Darn. Vaporeon takes the Surf and in comes Skarmory. Acid Armor. If this is Acid Armor Baton Pass, I am actually a big fan of that. Yeah. In comes Magneton. Extra defense against the Hidden Power Ground. Yolo Skarm. But doesn't look doesn't look like we have a Hidden Power uh, Ground Yolo Skarm. Sorry. Tyranitar is in. Takes a Thunderbolt. Wow. Even with defense plus two, that that uh, Magneton is gone. I guess I should have expected that. Vaporeon is back, substituting on the Magneton coming in. Uh, are we going to see another uh, Baton Pass, probably? Let's get something in for free. Here comes Tyranitar. Uh, your Skarmory is... Uh... Your Skarmory is gone, so Melodic is the answer to Tyranitar. Oh, and Claydol. So Claydol is actually a, probably a better answer. But it's still going to take a Hidden Power bug here and oh tyranitar is alive i think we are gonna see a bunch of pokemon go down here magneton endures will it be faster than the tyranitar though it's a lum dd tar so it's probably very fast it is faster all right salamence comes in it's gonna take a thunderbolt and it looks like to be a cb mince oh never mind a lum dd mince so Magneton goes down, and the team is sufficiently weakened, probably. 
Oh, but not for a Blissey. That Salamence is going to take a huge amount of health from Blissey and then go down here. Metagross will probably be coming in to uh, try and kill off Blissey here. No leftovers, so it is confirmed to be that CB Metagross. Misses the mash, and that's too bad. Takes a Seismic Toss. Goodbye, Blissey. I feel like Melodic should have come in and just tried to stall out the CB Metagross or something. Instead of... Uh, Letting Blissey go down? Blissey probably answered Vaporeon a lot better than Melodic would. There's the Substitute Recover. It's pretty standard. I mean, but a Substitute's gonna go to a, either a CB Metagross or... Uh, oh yeah, you can't... Can't click Surf there. You gotta switch or something. Can't just let it keep setting up. Yeah. Something is going to come in with plus three defense, and that was a physical tar. Physical tar is going to go down before it even does anything anyways. Ice beam melodic, but I mean, that's better to click than surf. Surf is not the play. But yeah, it is looking over. This Vaporeon kind of uh, walls the rest of the team. If it has anything, or if Gyarados comes in, that's, yeah... I don't think Gyarados is particularly going to care about Melodic, especially knowing that it isn't toxic, since that was revealed, volunteered information by Big Chungus. Gyarados can just uh, Dragon Dance a couple times, and and then try and uh, one-shot or two-shot Melodic. And that looks like it. Very quick set for our uh, inaugural uh, use of this mic. I'm pretty excited. Now that my uh, voice probably sounds a lot better. Sorry to anybody who uh, didn't like my choice of music. This is one of my favorite uh, tracks of all time, Pokemon music-wise. And Big Chungus decides to go out on his own terms. And unfortunately, I believe Big Chungus does exit the tour with that battle, as both battlers were 1 and 2. Uh, Big Chungus being uh, the Darwinist in the Discord... Uh, pretty uh, active member. We're sorry to see him exit the tour, but um, you know, I think both of these battlers have a bright future in Mons, and uh, we'll see them next time. Alrighty. Thank you, everyone, and uh, we'll be back shortly for more ADV Revival content.